Hey everyone, Kyle once again, and um, I'm just another doing another video that another um, another actor has now tragically passed away. Um, this time it's act it's it's actor uh, John Hurd. A uh, John Hurd. If anyone knows about the guy's name, probably a lot of people will know that he played Kevin McAllister's father in Home Alone one and two. Yes, yeah, that's John Hurd. Died at the age of seventy-two. I think that um, is said as the um, don't. I'm not sure what he exactly passed away from, but um, it's an, it's another sad thing. I'm like oh, John Hurd from Home Alone. Wow. But John Hurd, he also starred in. Um, I don't know the film I also remember him from. He was in um, the horror film from the nineteen eighty-four horror film uh, Chud. Which he also uh, starred along with Daniel Stern, who also be in Home Alone, who played Marv. But I, I enjoy Chuck. That's a good horror. That's a, that's a, uh, a good horror film. <clears throat> and he was, of course, um, I know he's been in lo uh, loads of other films, but mainly supporting roles. He was also in. Um, uh, it was a film that was called. It was a film called Awake. Uh, it was a film called Awakening, Awakenings with uh, De Niro and Robin Williams, um, Pelican Brief. There was there was a film. Um, I forget what it was called. It started with, he started with, started with Jeff Bridges. I forget the name. What the name is though. But um, and he also starred. He had a little supporting role in Shark, the first Sharknado. <laughs> Which is like really? Why is he in this? Why is he in this film? <laughs> And he's been also on lots of TV shows as well. My brother, um, he you remember him from the first. He he said that he, uh, he was in the he was in the first season of uh, Prison Prison Break. I haven't watched Prison Break. My brother he likes that show, but um, he was in the first season of Prison Break. Um, but that's, that's, that's a sad thing. John Hurd is is sad. And also, um, one thing I would have mentioned, uh, a, a couple a couple other people who also passed away, like. The past for over the past few days, the day that I do the day why the day I found out that George Air, that George Air Murrow passed away that same day um, that veteran actor Martin Lando also uh, passed away. Um, Martin now was really quick on that. Martin Lando has been in loads of many films, but I also remember ever a lot of people remember him. We started Tim Burns and Ed Wood. We he won the he won the Oscar for supporting actor when he played Bella Lugosi. Um, and he was also, he also, had, and I also remember that he also had a, in the opening of Tim Burns, um, Sleepy Hollow, the opening of the film, he was the first, he was the first, um, the guy, the guy who was, he was in the cornfield next to the scare, pumpkin head scarecrow and he got his head cup, chopped off, that was Martin Lando as well. So, yeah, Martin Lando, that's another, uh, veteran actor, passed away, I think he was in his 80s, I think, I forget, uh, I think it was like 80-something. So I'll quick, quick, I'll quick on that. So yeah, with Martin Lando and another person, um, Chester Ben Bennington, who was the lead singer in the band Lincoln Park. So, uh, at the age of forty-one, it's very young. Sadly, he hanged himself. I think I think I think they did hang himself. He, I know he committed suicide, but I think that he hanged himself. That's that's another that's another just another tragedy. And Lincoln Park. Even maybe probably people know some of their similar. I know there was one on well known band, well known band, but some of their songs played during the credits of a couple of the Transformer films. I remember the first one, then the third one. Um, and also for uh, um, Chester Bennington, when I looked up, I, know, I, when I looked up what he uh, was. I was like, he, he um, his face looked familiar. Like, oh yeah, I remember. He was in the la He was in the. I know they're making a, a new Saw film called Jigsaw that's coming out this October, but the last one that came out in 2010, Saw 3D, Chester Bennington, he was one of the victims. Do you, if you remember in which the the, the, the sequel of that film was this, uh, but if anyone remembers the the car trap, the victim that was glued to the seat, that's Chester Bennington. Bennington. The, yeah, so yeah, you, so you the here for Lincoln Park. He was in. The last, the, the last, the last soft film, um, 3D. He was the guy who was glued to the seat in the car, trying to reach the pull the lever, and the car sped up and it set up these, uh, killing these people, and then he flew into the windshield. 
So yeah, I was like, he was it. He wasn't Saw, three D. He was he was the guy that was glued. He was glued to the seat. I was like, oh wow, and I guess he has the little small roles in uh cr in Crank One and Two. I, I, I remember. I like Crank One and Two. I I I remember him being in the film, but I have to watch those again though. But I like Crank One and Two. But him, remember, like, really, he was in he was in Saw Three D. He was the guy who was glued to the seat. Wow. That totally sucks. So yeah, that's enough with Link. Um, we're getting, we're getting on with Lincoln Park. Um, the singer Chester Bennington. So may he rest in peace. Singing with Martin Landau, and now uh, now along with John Hurt. Now it's just the past few days. Everyone starts, you know. Wow. So yeah, first George A. Romero, then Martin Landau on the same day. Then he got Chester Bennington, and then uh, now John Hurt. So yeah, that's, that, that totally sucks. So I would just say that, you know, John Hurd, which now, which I haven't re I haven't reviewed Chud, though, so I'll have to uh, review that film sometime. But not now, because I have a couple of reviews that I'm, I'm doing, so, uh, that I want to do. But so, I'll, I'll, when, uh, soon, like, not, not, for, not that long, but I'll say sometime later, later down the road, I will review Chud. But, um, not right now, though. But I will do that, so, because, uh, you know, John Hurt, because I liked him in that film. And, of course, Home Alone 1 and 2. But, yeah. So, I'll say, rest in, you know, so rest in peace, John Hurt. Same with uh, Martin Lando, which I didn't know, know. As soon as after I did the video for George Romero, he had died away, passed on the same day. So, rest in peace, Martin Lando, and now with Chester Bennington, and now John Hurt. May all, may all rest in peace. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned on the next uh, movie review, and that's pretty much it. Once again, rest in peace to all, to, to all the ones I said, and we'll see you later.